All right, good afternoon, everybody. Welcome back to Simulation Station. So, I want to go back a little bit, guys. There's this game that we play. It's, it's this Train Mechanic Simulator 7. Or train, train Mechanic 77. I can't even talk. Train Mechanic 2017. Okay. It's a great game, guys. Well, we, you know, we, we played this back uh, about a year ago. Um, but it it is a lot better game than the the attention was that that I got on my channel uh, before, but we have grown quite a bit since then, and uh, I want to bring it back to some of my subscribers' attention. It's a great game, guys. It really is, um, and, and it, it kind of encompasses the best of all worlds. You know, you get to drive trains, you get to work on trains, you get to figure things out. It's it's really it's a good game. So we're gonna give it another try. We're gonna start from the beginning, guys. We're gonna go through a little bit of it, I'm, and then and your comments, your uh, your interest in this game is what's gonna continue to drive it. So uh, let's see how we do. Okay. So welcome to the game, Train Mechanic uh, 2017. Your train mechanic and your task will be to repair three different uh, in, or in three different workshops. Uh, under your care will be both archaic and simple steam engines as well as very modern electric locomotives. Each locomotive will be assigned to a garage adapted to repair its respective type. Good luck. All right, well, let's get started, guys. We're going to go right in here. This is where we receive our assignments. And we'll, you can, you know, stop the video and take a look at it. So we're going to go ahead and accept that. And these first few, of course, are, are really just kind of tutorial type. Okay. In this in this mode, you can strip down locomotives, taking apart their available components. Often to be able to get to a part, you will need to remove other parts, even those in operating properly. Those uh, operating properly. Please remember about this. Okay. There you have it, guys. So we're going to go to the... Uh, testing mode. In this mode you can check the condition of various train elements to estimate the profitable profitability of their repair. Remember the higher level of wear uh, individual elements the greater the risk of unsuccessful repair to that type of element. Alrighty let's, see, let's take a look at it first see what we think might be bad. That one's bad. That one's bad. That one's good. That one's good. All right, so let's go to the disassembly mode. And you can zoom in on these a little bit, or quite a bit, the way you want to look at it. Now, each one of these parts have got their respective bench. Hang on a minute, let me look at something here. Some of these other parts look like they might be bad, but now that you put them on this mode, they don't look bad. Okay, well, all right. <coughs> That's for your electrical parts, your mechanical parts, and then your hydraulic parts are down here on the end. Right, let's try to repair it. 100% chance of repair. 100% chance of repair. Let's go put them on. All right, that was done. So let's go to our tablet, which is T. See what we can do about well, nothing we can do. We don't have enough money. All right, let's go get our next assignment. Hmm. Uh, the driver complains about a faulty brake system. Locate the cause of, of the defect and make repairs. The work order is more sli is slightly more difficult. Remember that each part type repaired on a different workbench. If you are not able to repair the part yourself, you can buy a new part from the store using the tablet. Okay, this cat's having a little problem with brakes. Let's see what we can get into. There's your problems with your brakes right there, guys. Let's see. Make sure. Bam. Bam. Uh, 
I don't see any other problem to speak of. See any other brake problems? Everything else looks pretty good. We'll try it. Probably not. No, that one didn't repair. That one repaired. We'll go to the hydraulics bench. 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 Probably not going to be able to repair that one either. No. Nah. All right. Well, let's go to the tablet. So we need first. We need a brake caliper. Then we need a hydraulic brake piston. Gotta hang in there though guys, it just keeps getting better and better and better. Well, we bought a brake caliper. Ah, sometimes the camera's the hardest thing in the world to work with on this thing. That's going to be it. What do we want to do to improve the shot? these workbenches done first all right let's see what the next I think on this one we get to get in the train and go pick up some up yep. sometimes ta yep sometimes the task will involve finding and repairing locomotives that were damaged somewhere uh, on the route of the on the route of the game and then towing them to the appropriate workshop to make repairs for this purpose you use a special repair train this uh, this time a diesel locomotive broke down in square D1 locate it and tow it to the workshop Alrighty, we can do that. If I can figure out where the door is at, there you go. All right, this is the fun part, guys. Right here, to me, it is anyway. Let's go to our map. We're going to go up here to D1. That's two. This is D1 right here. All right. So, up. where are you going? Get your ass back up there. Train's going to be located up here. Matter of fact, it's located on this upper loop right here. So, let's get going. All right. So, we need to switch the city.
Oh crap! Hang on. Sorry, guys. Let's uh, let's do. Let's put this over here. There we go. That ought to help. We need to switch that. Switch to Diesel City Depot. to hmm hey hold on now yeah it's work that's it's good Got a pretty good ways to go. Got to remember to honk at these crossings, guys. Okay, West Asia Valley needs to be changed. North boundary to the east needs to be changed. We got a ways to go before we get to that one. This is a nice steady, uh, this nice steady pace, guys. Keep the train on tracks. Keep you from derailing. Yeah, that's where we need to be. Right there. We're all good. And I mean, what dude don't want to drive a train, man? I mean, really? We are. We should be good all the rest of the way there. Yeah. We're gonna go right outside of uh, D1 over to E1 for just a minute, but then we're gonna circle right back to D1. Let's head back to house. 
Let's just take a look at her map. Well, I'm thinking what center we're going to have to change. Everything else looks pretty good, though. Let's go ahead and get going. So far, so good. Scenery is beautiful too, guys, and it changes on e wherever you're at in the map. It changes. You can see off in the distance over there where we're heading. All looks good. You're looking good. My center. Okay, so West Center is really the only... Ah, damn it. Did it again. Let me hit him. As soon as West Center comes up, we'll get it changed. Center should be popping up just any second. There it is. Looking good. Nice size train sitting there waiting on us. Everything looks like it's exactly where it's supposed to be now, guys. So we should be able to just sit back and enjoy the ride.
Storm a little bit out here this morning, isn't it? We're going to circle back to the right here, and then we will be, oh, you know, Engine Depot. Yeah, I'm glad we saw that. All right, let's sail on in there. Houses there belongs to a friend of mine. All right, we are just about there. What did I do? Okay. We went ahead and came to the, uh, the shop, guys. I do apologize. I had something I had to take care of real quick. All right. Let's pull up that work order and look at the reminder cell. We found the engine. Uh, just expect the problem appeared to be a damaged transmission. Oh, okay. The transmission's on the engine here. And if I'm not mistaken, they're on the front and the back. I know. Just these two right here. Let's see if they're on the uh, back transmissions as well. Does not appear to be so. All right. Let's get these bad boys fixed. Oh, 15%. We're not going to get fixed at it. Guarantee you we're not. Yeah. These things are ungodly expensive. All right, so we need two drive gears. $46,000 a piece, guys. Almost $100,000 to fix this train. Mm. But when you consider the type of money that these uh, these bad boys make, and that's gonna do it. Wow. All right, let's go back over to the workshop and see what we can do to improve it. If we got enough money, well, we got a little bit. We got a little bit. Let's go ahead and get that screw gun. All right, let's see what our next job is going to be, guys. All right. I'm going to do something. Give me just a second, guys. Uh, man, I don't want to move it. Make it too much smaller. All right. Give that a try. Uh, the main railway station informed us that an abandoned uh, a locomotive pulling passenger cars has not arrived on time. Check what happened. That means we get to hit the tracks again, guys. Yeah, buddy. Guys, you know, just give this game a try. It is it is really an outstanding game. It really is. It, it's a good game. It's a, it's a great game. You know, it's got trains in it. It's just a really manly game. 
All right, uh, it said that was on at E4. Let's pull our map up. E4. There's E, there's three, there's two. So E4 is right here. Somewhere right in here. So we, we don't have far to go. And then we're going to circle back around and, and find it. So it looks like everything is set good to go. So far, anyway. And you will get got you, you. It will get to where you can just run it at a normal speed and and see these when they come up. You don't even have to make the map larger. But I it's been a while since I played, so I'm gonna err on the side of caution. Find the derailed train near the coast. Alrighty. We should be happening up on it here just any minute, guys. Well, we are in E4 now. So if you noticed a while ago, we were in the mountainous forest region. Now we're on the coast region. We should be happening up on that train just any second. There it is. We need to watch that. If you get an X down here on the bottom, it'll tell you. Any second now. I think I just passed it. Come on now. I gotta go back a little bit and see if that doesn't work. Come on now. There it is. There we go. Alright. Get over here where we can see. Now I'm not real good at this guy, so y'all bear with me. Alright, boom. I think the best way to do this might be from behind. I do not want to hit that tree. Come on, come on. There she goes.
There we are. That's much better. I need to bring that boom around just a little bit. Come on now. Did you come up with you? There we go. Just a little bit. We'll start bringing this bad boy around. We need to bring that boom out just a little bit. Trying to put it back on the tracks is what we're trying to do, guys. I forget which is which. Even E. WAS. There we go. Rotate A and D. Still needs to go out just a little bit. So we need to rotate. Just a hair. Angle is one, let's get it to zero. And I think we can almost set that bad boy down right there. Almost. This angle just a little bit off, isn't it? Oh wow, I'm way off. Yeah, I'm way off. My oh, damn. Back. I need to come back over this way a bit. Definitely need to go down, don't I? Pretty good right there. There it is. Alrighty. All right, let's take a look at the map. We're going to circle back around. Everything looks like it's switched. Everything looks like it's uh, switched to diesel. Switch to diesel engine depot. That's the one we need to. So let's get her going. Whoa. We need quite that much, do we? Take her home and fix her, guys.
And you know, guys, you you may have you may already have this game. You may you know bust it out, guys. Dust the uh, dust the dust off of it and and uh, and play with it a little while. Uh, everything gets stale unless you play with it, guys. You know what I mean? <laughs> if you don't use it, it quits working. My wife looked at me and laughed. <laughs> Just give me an amen on them comments, guys. Give me an amen. I'm fixing to make a pretty good turn here, so let's... Uh, Slow it down just a little bit. You know, we've got trains, we've got planes, and automobiles, guys. It just don't get much better than Simulation Station, I'm telling you. All right, let's take a look at the map. Yep, everything looking real good. Let's go to switch to Diesel Road Depot. Take another look at it. Looking good, looking good. Now Diesel Engine Depot, we need to switch. should get us home. That's it. Lars's house there. They need to mow their yard. Home sweet home. This is a diesel locomotive shop. Made it home. Let's go to repair. You done? <laughs> My wife's painting today. She's quite the little artist. All right. Appears the problem is damaged mounting brackets in both trucks. All right. Mounting brackets. We know where those are at. Those are right on the front of both. Let's get that out of there. Now we're taking these bolts off a little faster. Let's check these out and make sure they're in good shape too. Yeah, everything looks pretty good all around it. Now, come on. Cameras is a problem. Cameras are a problem, guys. I pro uh, just work with them. Be patient. You'll find your spot. One thing that's great about these, though, they're all mechanical. And mechanical items seem to repair a lot better and save you a lot of money. You make a lot of money on them. I would have liked a little better sound uh, on this, but it's not going to happen. No. 
I don't know. What's that flashing for? That's in good shape. All right. Oh, that ain't what I want. I know it's bad, guys. Right now, I, th I think you can pick this game up for next to nothing on Steam, so... I mean, it is. It's four years old. But it's still worth every penny, guys. Let's go get them fixed. That's it. 
That is it. Made some scratch on that one, guys. When time you got to go to work? Oh, you don't go in today? Gotcha. All right, let's go back to the make a couple of improvements. Yeah, we need to improve these a little more than we need to do anything else. Alright guys, that is going to be our first video. It just kind of gives you a taste of the game. Uh, we got to go out and pick up a couple of engines. Uh, beautiful day. We got to drive in the rain and the sun. Uh, do a little repair. It is just, I'm telling you guys, it's a fantastic game. And please, leave me a comment and let me know what you think about it. Um, I, I want to do more. I'm going to play more. I'm going to do uh, more just on my own, but I would love to do some more videos on it, guys. If you like it and you want to see some more, um, let me know. Uh, if you want to play the game, go to Steam, pick it up. I guarantee you, you can pick it up for probably next to nothing. So, anyway, guys, y'all have a great day, and we'll see you next time.